good morning so today i'm gonna go to the gym i've got to edit a vlog a main channel video um well it's already edited i've just got to like just cut it down once again go through it upload it do the thumbnail and the description box louis has been doing this my arms are so rich you guys like in here it hurts. Let me use my tripod. This is too sore. Louis has been doing this thing all week. If I sound tired, he like starts from like 5 a.m. He just jumps on me. I don't know why he's been doing it. It's like he's being sassy. Like he actually knows he shouldn't be doing it because I wake up and I tell him off and he runs off and he like looks at me and he's just like, yeah, bitch. And what? So I'll just be like asleep and he'll just literally do the biggest jump and land straight on my stomach or straight on my back. And it's like, terrifying because I'm deep asleep I'm like ah <laughs> and it's like why are you doing this because like he cries for Hamish to wake up because he wants to be fed real early because Hamish screwed up like years ago when he was studying he's waking up at like 5 a.m to study and he'd just feed the dogs so now like they've kept the habit so Hamish usually just ignores them and it usually is fine like they'll just kind of sleep and wake up and cry and go back to sleep and wake up and cry and then we'll feed them at like 8 a.m but like lately it's like because Hamish will sleep through them crying and I will sleep through them crying. They've decided, well, Louis has decided just to start leaping on me. <laughs> I'm so angry at him. He's such a little shit. I gave him cuddles this morning to, so that he knows I'm not actually angry, but I am angry. Ugh. Is this what it's like having a child? <laughs> now he's just sleeping peacefully in the sun. Nice for some. A little keto loss update. I feel like since going back to the gym, everything's just came to a halt. Like my weight loss, not everything, just my weight loss. So I'm trying not to get hung up on my weight because for me, my weight always fluctuates a lot. So I'm happy that it's kind of just staying the same. Um, and I know that I'm sure I'll start seeing more results like physically. I haven't taken photos in a couple weeks So like I'm just gonna keep doing what I'm doing and in a couple more weeks I'm gonna take some more photos and just compare and Just see how my clothes are fitting and everything because I need to have faith in like the system, you know Just like trust the process because I'm obviously probably building a lot of muscle at the moment Well not a lot but there's definitely some muscles happening right now. It's so sore. And my legs are getting so toned already. Like, my thighs, like, I'm starting to see what's the front. I'm so bad with muscles, you guys. I was the worst in PE. The front thigh muscle, the front of your leg. Um, it's starting to get real nice and hard and defined, which I used to have such nice defined legs from doing the cross trainer all the time when I used to just do cardio. Um... So I'm seeing like changes in like my muscles and stuff and muscle weighs more than fat and blah 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 blah. Um, so yeah, I need to stop caring about the number on the scale and it's always different. Like if you guys saw my weight loss on more Shannon Xo on Instagram, like it was so up and down all over the show. Some weeks I lost like 300 grams, some weeks I lost like over a kilo or like, you know, and some weeks it was just nothing. So I just need to like not care about that. And just a reminder to you guys for the same. Especially if you're working out like like I said my goal isn't even weight loss anyway to be fair Like I really just want to get more fit at this stage and like muscular muscular Musclier Get some toning going on tone down my stomach and stuff which does involve some fat loss loss as well Of course, but do you know what I mean? Like I don't know. I just want to feel real strong which I'm starting to feel um, Even though I'm not I'm actually very weak, but for me, I'm starting to feel strong <laughs> So it's like a real good feeling. I want to get a lot more fit so I can start doing more like tracks and stuff. I don't know. Oh my god. Okay. Done. Today was like a freaking struggle. Um, I got like 40 minutes through and I was just like I want to like pick up and leave. But I didn't. I did an hour. Um, and 165 max heart rate. 587 calves. Honestly, I felt like I would have done it so many more cows because I was just sweating my freaking ass off. Literally, I had sweat dripping down my face and like falling on my chest. It was yuck. I feel good now. So I'm definitely going to film today. I really need to do the try on portion of the ASOS stuff because that arrived like a week ago and I kind of semi forgot about it. So I need to film that. Um, most stuff should still be in stock at least. So yeah, I need to get onto it. Probably put it up like next week if I can. Um, yeah, we were gonna go to the beach house this weekend, but we're not anymore. We're just gonna hang out at home Whew. So I'll probably do some editing over the weekend and stuff anyway. I need to shower and then put up today's video 
<laughs> I got a note. It says, I'm trying to hide my address right now. Right back at you. I wonder which one of my friends sent these. <laughs> See, now I don't know. These are so beautiful. Oh my god, and succulents. Oh, I love it. Oh my god, I'm going to try and like grow these succulents. <laughs> So I live streamed, did my makeup, filmed my ASOS try on haul of all the stuff that you guys sent me. And there's actually like three or four things I love and then like three or, things, three or four things I hate, but that's okay. <laughs> so I'll probably edit that soon and get that up in like a week or two for you guys. It is now almost five o'clock, so I'm going to try and get my vlog edited. These flowers are so freaking beautiful. <sighs> thumbnail so i'm just finishing off editing my vlog put that up when i get home me and hamish are gonna go out friday night dinner gonna go get in a skin dome and everyone ages all like salad because i can't have rice and stuff but this highlight looks so ugly in this lighting right here Ooh. i just said to hamish huh? that huh? i think we should go to the warehouse huh? and buy succulents i know what happens what i know what happens what happens you know what happens I don't know what you're talking about. You do. I have something in my eye. I don't know what you're talking about. What happens? How hot it is. What? Nah, you can't kill succulents. Though. Yes, no. you can kill succulents. Have you killed one before? No. I bet you you have. If anyone would have killed a succulent, it would have been you. Shannon and I got a mixed grill that we're trying. We're not allowed to rice, so that's just there. That's garnish. And uh, the usual chicken salad, but from here what you do is you go, I uh, can I have a large chicken salad, double meat with mayo, extra mayo, and no carrot, no couscous, and no mint sauce. And then it's, it's not terrible. Is it good? This is the wine choice of the night that we're trying. So it's good. It's quite strong. It's quite strong. It's 1 a.m. fam. We've been playing cod all night. We've got a couple of wins. Some good games. <sighs> good night. Good morning. It's Monday. Um, this week I've got like the freaking busiest week ever. So I don't know. Oof. If you've noticed I've not been uploading a shit ton of vlogs. Well I kind of have been still. Like I haven't been slack but Ooh, I've got to film like six videos this week like film and edit six videos this week if I can for Japan I mean if I can't I'll just drop down to two uploads for the week But I want to get three up and I need to have a couple of uploads prepared for when I get back from Japan in case I'm jet lagged and tired and Or sick or something, but I still want to go to the gym and stuff So I'm off to the gym today. I've got to edit a lot and I might do the declutter later this afternoon So don't wear makeup it's a lot. It's a lot today. So I just took my thyroid medication. Now I am going to open some mail with you guys because I have to wait half an hour after taking it before I can do any like pre-workout or food or anything. So I need pre-workout. I'm dead. It's Monday, honestly. It is the most beautiful day today. It's almost too sunny to film, but yeah, I like guess I'm going to edit first, so we'll see what happens later on. We'll start clearing out all the packages out of the spare room for when... I has it has come like while we're in Japan because there's no room in there right now It's like so messy and just cluttered with boxes Nine shadows 27 swatches How does it work? Oh, okay, so there's a neutral primer and a black primer so it changes the way the product looks I suppose there's two products. Let me know if you guys want to see me use these in a first impression of some kind. This is from MYM Beauty. Valentine's Day, we've got the perfect gift for the love in your life. Every purchase from the Rudkin range on mym.co.nz will receive a free stolen Girlfriends Club laptop bag while it stocks last. A stolen Girlfriends Club laptop bag, which is actually quite cute. I like that. Oh, the new shades. 
of the liquid eye shadow. I'm real excited for this teal one. But that's how the shades look. Now we're something from YSL Beauty. Rouge Volup Shine Collector. Rouge Tuxedo. So cute. And it's a shine. So a shiny red. Volup Plump in Color. Shade 7. This is one of those black balms. I don't really know what it does. Looks like that. And then just a bunch more of those plumping colors as well. Midi palette, feeling myself. Pretty little highlighter palette. Some bath bombs. And oh my God, I love these. I put these in the freezer. These are so good for when you're sick. I already have one. It's like a teal color one. You can like put them, oh, it's wrapped up. You can put them in the fridge or in the freezer. I put them in the freezer. And it's just an eye mask. It's real good for puffiness, but also just like if you've got like a bit of a fever or something, it's real nice just to cool you down or if you're just hot in general. Oh my God, a little love heart post-it notes. And then we've got a mini lip set right here. have a shower i feel like i'm not that red today oh i take that back um my hair is so sweaty it's not even funny like it's drenched at the roots it feels revolting i took my hair down to try and like see if it would like dry out a bit <laughs> but yeah time to go wash my hair have a shower i really feel like filming and i was thinking to myself you know what filming is the most important thing to me right now because I love it and also because I can always do a little bit of editing on the plane if it comes to that like if I really 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 need to at least like you know if I focus on like filming that's the most important part to get the content and then the editing can come afterwards so yeah because at the moment I don't have enough like videos filmed so I think I might film something this afternoon I was thinking of doing a new everyday makeup routine because I've kind of got a new one and um I might do a declutter like I said earlier because I keep saying I'm gonna do a declutter today and I keep you know getting so busy with other stuff and editing my vlogs and stuff so yeah I really want to try and edit a vlog today as well because it is Monday I really like putting up a vlog on Mondays because <sighs> usually I don't get my like Friday content up on the weekend because on the weekend I just kind of take a break from the editing and a break from the filming a little bit but I do want to start vlogging a little bit more on weekends it's just that I literally like take the weekend to do nothing it's crazy like I am literally the most lazy pe person on the weekends like we'll do a few chores walk the dogs or whatever and then I pretty much just like game and cook like me and Hamish cook some stuff and that's it it's like kind of boring so I usually like live stream on the weekends instead plus I don't get like a lot of chances to live stream during the day during the week but I don't know we'll see I cannot wait for Tokyo holy shit it's only like a week and a half away also Ainsley and the twins are coming this Friday I'm so excited to see them so I'll vlog a little bit of them um for those of you who watched my vlog my Australia one when I went to stay with her for a week when they were only three months old so how old are they now like five months six and five months don't know but <laughs> yeah I'm so excited to see them and they look like they're so much bigger and they're starting to like hold their bottle and stuff like that like laugh and smile whereas when I was like visiting they were just starting to kind of like laugh occasionally but you could tell they were just laughing at nothing they weren't really laughing at stuff we were doing whereas like now on Ainsley's snapchat she'll like tickle them and stuff and they giggle or she'll like sing to them or do funny faces and they smile and Hamish will also be meeting them all right team I just put up my Valentine's Day tutorial make sure you go check it out I'm loving your comments so far I'm so obsessed with the makeup as well like I really want to start doing my makeup like that all the freaking time just with different colors like it's so pretty but anyway I'm just gonna make a quick coffee we've got no cream so I'm just doing almond milk today um, which is a okay getting groceries tonight after the gym. We've already ordered it I've got freaking like water stuck in between the two layers of this. And I don't know how to get it out Like how did it even get in there? Finally convinced Hamish to start having collagen with me too sometimes <laughs> Which I don't know if that's a good thing so now I'm gonna have to freaking repurchase it twice as fast Oh no, it's 
sort of pulling out the top. Yum. Oh, so good. When I do just almond milk, I usually use a little bit more. So I probably use about 100 mil rather than like 50 mil. You know, look how beautiful my flowers are. I still don't know who sent them. Look how beautiful they look still. And the ones my mum got me as well look perfect still. I'm just obsessed. They are so stunning and literally just brighten up my day every single time I have a single glance at them. I honestly need to start just having flowers in my home more often because they make me real happy. Like the older I get, the more I appreciate them. Like they're just so beautiful. And they just like really brighten up the room and just... Yeah, it's even more special obviously when someone else gets them for you because it reminds you of someone even though I don't know who got me these so I just kind of think of my friends when I look at them but like, you know. Looking for some more succulents. I can't find any I don't have yet. Like I feel like Mitre 10, Bunnings and The Warehouse all have the exact same ones that I already own. Like the same like three or four friggin' kinds that I, you know, like the look of. But online I see all these beautiful like purple ones and red ones and like just different green ones that I don't own and I'm like where the heck do people get these so I need to go look at some like specialist plant shops or something I think but I don't know where like <laughs> and I don't know how to go about like ordering them online like I don't know if they're allowed to be imported to New Zealand and stuff like that so I don't know I just love succulents so much I just think they look stunning I love green like this is my favorite shade of green green's my favorite color which is random I know because everyone would think it's pink but I just love green because it I don't know, I just find it to be a very calming colour. Does anyone else feel like that? Like, I look at green and I feel very good. It's weird. I think my Nana's favourite colour was green too. Because remember that time I asked her what, uh, what colour nails I should do? And she was like, green. <laughs> but I don't think she would have liked this type of green. She would have been like, ugh. I love the neon though. But anyway, time to go film. That might just have been one of my favourite declutters I have ever freaking filmed. Like, it was so fun. I did a lot of organising, a lot of readjusting. And moved a whole lot of stuff around so it was really good and satisfying yeah <laughs> also i did my makeup everyday makeup routine so yeah i am gonna go edit now it's 3 33 so i'll probably go to the gym in an hour and a half as well again just do some workouts um like muscle workouts rather than cardio because i did cardio this morning this coffee's so good hey guys just got back from the gym i did tie up my hair and it's freaking sweaty again i tried to do some like cross trainer but it was like right where the sun was coming through the windows and it was so freaking hot you guys it's like ridiculous hot today so instead i walked on the um treadmill for like half an hour while i waited for him to get to the gym he was like 20 minutes late that's right um i got all my steps in for the day and then we just worked out shoulders and it killed me i think we were there for like well i was there for like an hour and a half after all that already burnt over 2250 calories today which is in bed for someone that sits on her ass all day working louis it's not being dramatic he's being dramatic what really it's an interesting story do you want me to play here comes hamish with the groceries come here come on then it's too big for you it's too big for you are you gonna let go? Okay. He's like, ooh, dad's home.
Honestly, that salad is like one of my favorite meals. We're gonna do some live streaming now. Play some COD. Um, yeah, that's the plan for the night. Did so much work today and it feels real good. I think we got about four wins tonight, so I'm just gonna take off my makeup and go to sleep because I'm freaking tired after working out a bunch. Good night.